Be gone. Leave me be, whoever you is. Get away. Calm down. It's over. Aye, it's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd a heard the cries, sir. If you'd a heard how a man can scream, how he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see, and the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange, the toads, I cannot hear them. through and through. Hendrik screamed. Then he begged. By the end, he could do naught but moan. the terrors, yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. You in that hut when they rode off? No, and I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. Him. Maybe they missed something. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. Damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Should check his boots. Blood, congealed, key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole, somewhere nearby, hopefully. There's a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning.
valuables left unlocked, on display, almost. Lost his mind, or... Mm. Ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrick was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige, also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged, ashen hair, scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle, or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talked to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp, encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Ciri. Thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. An ill looking <laughs> So, you tried to turn him? Did you really love it? I, she did indeed. Didn't she? Someone's coming. Heard you talking about a witch. I'd like. You are wrong. And you've wandered too far. Meager hovels here, that's all. You should get back on the high road whence you came. About that witch. 
Leave us be or I'll call me man. Witch's hut is somewhere nearby. Miss! Cows are wheezing. Won't rise from the barn floor. Pus streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, miss, but you know things. Tis our last cow. None other left in the village. Rest died of hunger. Or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn. Thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. She's in a foul mood. We'd best come back on the morrow. Watch what you say. She's quick to hire. Apt to take revenge. The bitch is in a proper fury. Needs a man. special. Now where's she run off to? Managed to amass quite a book collection. some artifact or so this is where she disappeared to
I'm upstairs. Don't be shy. Greetings, Witcher. Mr. Spot. Hmm. Where? Hope you didn't come to court. No. To talk. Turn around and wait. Kira met deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Foltest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. Hmm, someone's grown irritable. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. Now tell me what brings you here. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh really? Who? Apparently she quarreled with the local witch. <laughs> Someone's been feeding you horseshit. The girls around here are too stupid to quarrel with me. She's not from here. You're up to something, Geralt. If I'm to help you, you must tell me what's going on. Who are you looking for? Siri. Siri? Well, now I understand the secrecy, not to mention the brooding, the furled brow. And do you say she had some sort of problem with a witch? So you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. My undying gratitude. Good enough. It's nothing to sneeze at, but you've a knack for getting into trouble. I should probably ask for something more immediately deliverable. Oh, sod it. Don't give me that look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. No flea-bitten scoyotel slob either, but an elven mage. What was an elven mage doing in Velen? Well, I tried to ask him, of course, about everything. Of course. Oh, but you know how elves are. He asked many more questions than he answered. He say what his name was? He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. He was intelligent and composed. He said what he wanted with Siri. Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. He leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins near the village of Midcops. I'll go there with you. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I've unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, that she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. Let's go then. Yes, let's. This is the place. 
been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised or else his waif would appear. At any rate, I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Come on! Thought you were in a hut. Gavella Glan. That means... I, I thought they didn't exist. Feast your eyes on the non-existent then. Hmm. Got a navigator with them. Uh, what? Can you teleport us to the other side? I'd rather teleport us home. Do you really mean to follow them? Teleport. Hurry up. I'm not sure I like any of this. Kira.
spell. Fine, won't say anything. So what happened to you? There's something here, something that distorts teleportation. I've no idea how they managed to get to the other side problem free. Wild Hunt's teleportation magic is different. Got specially trained mages for that. Navigators, they call them. They can have three helmsmen and a parrot for all I care. I'll not risk that again. Let's go. Wild Hunt got a good head start on us, but we still stand a chance. Have you gone completely mad? We must leave here at once. I gotta know what the Wild Hunt's doing here. But we came to find the Elven Mage, not fight the Hunt. If they reach him first, we won't get a chance to talk to him. Besides... Go on. Finish. Wait. You've got some special interest in the Hunt. Is this about Siri? There's something you've not told me, isn't there? Come with me and maybe I will. Are you always like this? I'm beginning to feel sorry for Triss and Yen. Oh, very well. Let's go. Gvela Glan. That's him! That's the elf! What was that? An illusion? No. A morphotic projection. A what projection? Something akin to a post box for mages. Much safer than an ordinary letter, which anyone can intercept en route to its recipient. The message was definitely for Ciri, daughter of the Gull, Laura Doran's heir. Indeed. It is what the elves would title Ciri. But what was the bit about the sign of her sword? A riddle? Yeah, not a hard one, though. Not if you know Ciri named her sword Tzideo. Swallow. Come now. Who aside from you would know that? Might have been the point. Your elven mage secured the passage, hid it, so that only Ciri could find it. He failed to foresee that someone like you would show up. Nevertheless, I think he was expecting uninvited guests. Made some preparations. Let's hope the Wild Hunt ran into some obstacles. Well then, let's go. Do you think following the Swallows will suffice? We'll see. An old elven port. Must have been how they got here by sea. I wonder how long ago that was. Careful. That oily yellow vapor, it's toxic. I hardly need instruction from you. I recognize the bone pile around immediately. <laughs>
follow. Seems we're headed the right way. Similar to that other pillar with the projection. Sirel, me for the sol eser. Sirel, me for the sol eser. Ainsila Kelpi. Kelpi? Does he mean that sea monster? No, that's what Siri named her mare. Horse could apparently gallop like a demon. Hmm. <laughs> Good name for a horse. So, shall we look for it? Gavella Glan. Hunting dog. Can't see any connection to Kelpie. Oh, must you tuck? I wonder what all this means. They look hastily screwed. Geralt, are you all right? You might say so. Teleportation. This very portal. And I know why I landed in that drowner nest. You should be pleased you emerged from the portal in one piece. And everyone still wonders why I hate to be teleported. We must try to activate it. I think that's a swallow. Come. Sure it's safe. Of course. The elven mage prepared this passage for Siri. Come on now.
glad. And that thought you were in a hurry. Once you finally find Siri, what will you do? Any plans? Depends what she wants. Imagine it. How it will transpire. What will she say? What will she look like? No. I'm sorry. For getting ahead of myself. At times I forget. We hardly know each other. Certainly not enough to discuss personal matters. Not to worry. We'll get there. Teleport over there. We must activate it quickly. You swallow. Look, it works! Come on! Look, we've managed to cross the bridge. This is where we saw the Wild Hunt. Great. Means they're way ahead of us. Come on. Vela Glan. Wild hunt. Definitely. They destroyed the major sentries. I didn't come here for a friendly chat with the elf. Meaning you ever thought they might have froze them before they could attack? Shut up!
pass. That took a great deal of power. Just don't faint on me. <laughs> now, in your firm embrace, not in your life. <laughs> mm. Love to be able to say we could stay here a while and rest. I know. I know. We must go on. Block the passage. Maybe I can try. Leave it to me. I came with you. You'd never have managed without me, would you? Come now, admit it. Yeah, never. He awaits us.
Stay calm. Focus. Laboratory. Look, the elf left oh, another message for Siri. Lorena Luna. All right, let's watch this message. Sirel, this place is no longer safe. Do not tarry here long. Trust no one. And above all, beware the witches of Crookback Bog. Try to reach the place where last we were together. Where last we were.
we were together, not much to go on. Damn it. Perhaps it's best he didn't leave a clearer message. The Wild Hunt broke in here, surely they saw the projection. They searched everything, and if they had more time, they'd probably have torn the place to the ground. But that doesn't change the fact that we haven't learned anything. Not about the Elf, not about Ciri. Well, we know they were well acquainted, and traveling together. Wonder why they split up. Perhaps because the Wild Hunt was on the Elf's trail, and Ciri would be safer if they did. The Witches of Crookback Swamp. Crookback Bog. Kira, if you're hiding something... But... I didn't say... You know these witches? I've never met them, but I've read of them. In an old manuscript I found in one of the huts in the village. It mentions the village witches venturing into Crookback Bog at times, to liaise between the villagers and the crones, the ladies of the wood. The crones appear to be intolerant of outsiders, but they help the local folk. Apparently, they stopped the spread of the plague in Bellum. Hmm. What's your take on this? I'd love to shrug it off as the nattering of so many old women, yet... Throughout my first fortnight in Velen, I had horrible nightmares. Something was calling me out into the swamps. One night, I decided to enter the dream consciously. Render it lucid. I confronted the thing directly. It broke contact at once. Peaceful nights ever since. Why didn't you say anything earlier? I told you Siri had a run in with a witch. Well, I had no idea you meant then. If I'd told you something, you would have rushed off to find them. But we needed first to confirm that Siri was here, didn't we? I shall tell you everything now, of course. Now? After I safely led you through the cave? I can't believe you'd think so poorly of me. Perhaps you do bear a grudge against sorceresses. Mm-hmm. Can't imagine where that comes from. How do I find them? The swamps are vast. Dangerous. But they say the crones mark the way for peasants who wish to visit them. The manuscript mentions a chapel in Crookback Bog. And from that chapel, one must follow a trail of treats. Treats? Of course. They didn't read you bedtime stories at Care Morgan. All normal folk know that witches live in gingerbread houses poised atop chicken legs. I'll have to see that to believe it. Take the tome and read it. I... I truly do believe you'll find your Cirilla. All right then. As a start, let's look for a way out of here. Good idea. Why do we even come? 